Yo, what is going on everybody? The new Evil Goblin drill has finally come out. And in all honesty, in my opinion at least, it honestly sucks. It is not a good Evo whatsoever. And honestly, it gets killed really, really easily. Especially since since I've been using the Evo Goblin drill, like as soon as I put it in my deck, I have not versed a person. I was literally about to say it. Who does not have Valkyrie, who does not have Wizard, Mega Knight, um, Executioner, Bomb Tower, freaking Bomber, anything that literally has AoE spread, I have been versing every single, like, version. Like, it is honestly insane. Alright, so this guy is Wall Breakers. My Tesla should actually be able to kill the first one. Alright, so I just realized I'm actually using Dagger Duchess, but it's honestly not bad. I will actually switch to Princess after this, just to show it off. But, just freaking... Like, this deck is honestly just terrible, in my opinion. Not even not even the deck, I mean, um, the freaking just Evo in general. So, I will actually go Goblin Drill now that my knight is walking up. Hopefully, I can get some damage, but this Evo is honestly just super, super underwhelming. Just because it looked, like, so, like, overpowered and so good when uh, YouTubers used it and stuff. And it looked like, oh my god, like, this Evo needs an emergency nerf. But in all honesty, it really is not that good. Like, it really did look a lot better in the trailers and stuff and it looked like it was going to be like the new best evo it needs like an emergency nerf right away but it really isn't that good like you guys could see like it isn't even just the deck like i'm just getting way too over pressured right now i can't even get a goblin drill in and even when i do get a goblin drill in i can't do anything with the goblin drill because he's gonna please valkyrie look at that literally you can't do anything like the fact that like evo goblin drill don't get me wrong it's a, it's a good evolution like, except for the fact that so many things counter it. And the fact that normal Goblin Drill isn't that good anymore, it literally makes it so you rely on your evil Goblin Drill so much to do all your damage. And I can't even freaking win right there. I did miss the log, but either way, I would have just freaking lost my tower right there. And he just starts pressuring the other side. So I will go test it just to freaking stop those bomber or wall breakers right there, sorry. And then I will go Magic Archer with that freaking Goblin Drill. Now you guys can see, he just goes freaking Valkyrie. What is the Valkyrie going to do? It's just going to kill every single goblin that spawns. Everyone said, oh, Valkyrie's probably like the worst freaking, um, the worst counter. It has to walk to it. It doesn't even matter if it has to walk to it because it freaking, it, it just doesn't even spawn that many goblins. Like, the fact that it dies and it does spawn goblins is good. That is a good fact, but sometimes when your drill pops back up, it doesn't even spawn a goblin. It just dies before it can spawn a goblin. So it will die, spawn the one goblin on its death, and then not do any damage. So you guys can see, I lost this match completely heavily, but we're going to go into the next one and try a different type of deck. Alright, so this is just a deck that I made, and the other deck that I was using one was was a uh, one that Riley CR made, and he actually was using it against Ian77, and I don't even know how he won. I honestly feel like it could have been possibly, like, staged. Obviously, I don't want to, like, freaking, um accuse anything but it just seemed like so unreal how riley was able to win with the goblin drill and like i just can't win one match like it just seems so unreal okay so i could just go tesla for that mini pecker right there i honestly forgot to freaking switch my um what's called my freaking princess tower from dagger duchess to princess that's my own fault I did switch the deck so i had i didn't even freaking switch it for the next deck that's my own fault we did have a good defense right there so last match honestly wasn't that good in my opinion just because i didn't even play that well but even when you when you do play well you literally like can't do that much if they have a good defense for your goblin drill so goblin drill goes down so he actually goes goblin giant in the back he's giving me this tower basically he's literally just starting a push on the left he's Okay, maybe he's not giving me the tower, but he basically was just like not defending it and actually allowed me to get some damage. So we are actually doing good right now. I want to keep that in mind. We are doing decent. Last match, we weren't doing that well, but since we are doing decent in this match, I just want to show how like even when you're doing good with Evil Goblin Drill, it could still turn on you very, very fast. Even though I do have Dagger Duchess, it, it, it honestly isn't that much of a problem, but because he doesn't have like log bait or anything. All right, so... The wizard will actually end up walking up. I could just go knight in the back just to tank for anything he does place. He goes mini P.E.K.K.A. We'll have to go dark prince up high just because the dark prince does have a shield obviously. So we'll actually be able to tank a hit from the mini P.E.K.K.A. Alright so I will actually go goblin drill on the right side now. He goes freaking sparky. Uh, I do have void for that. Which I will actually end up using. Um, so he goes minions on my freaking goblin drill. They do actually end up getting some hits so that's nice. It's honestly so surprising in this match that I'm not 
versus someone who immediately just Valkyries or Wizards my freaking Goblin Drill because that's what's literally been happening. So we're going to see what we can do here. Um, we'll go Wizard in the back just to help for the defense. And obviously I do get a cycle for that Evo. Um, we're going to see what I can do. Is he just not going to place anything? It's honestly so surprising if this guy just gives me the match here. Just because this would literally be the first match that I win without someone just giving me the match. Alright, so yeah, I think this guy actually just gave me the match. Somehow this guy freaking... I, I, I don't know why he just gave me the match. But, um... Alright, bro. So this actually kind of didn't go as planned. I actually wanted to show off how bad the Evil Goblin Drill is, but... Kind of just gave me the match, but... Uh, either way, it doesn't really show it off, but we're going to go to the next one. All right, going to this one, we're reversing Diana. All right, so for this Goblin Drill deck, this one is basically like a Log Bait deck, but you have Goblin Drill instead of Goblin Barrel. All right, so yeah, I actually did end up switching the Dire Duchess back because I feel like with this type of deck, it definitely would be better to have Princess since you can distract really well and keep your uh, towers hitting their troops. So I could go Tesla up high for that Mini P.E.K.K.A. We'll actually go E-Spirit. I don't think I need to use Goblin Gang for it, just because Tesla will actually help kill it really fast. Yeah. So, yeah, that's nice for me. I didn't even have to go with the Goblin Gang. We'll actually go Princess on the left side just to counter pressure, just because he's going to have to defend that now. Yeah, you can't use Firecracker on the right side. He might actually go with, um, what's it called? Hog Rider. I feel like that's probably the deck he's running since he has a Valkyrie. Yeah, there it goes. Knew it was going to be freaking Hog Rider deck. We can, we'll go Log and, um, oh my god, it's not good. Damn, my knight was supposed to freaking go after his firecracker right there, but honestly, that's alright. He goes mini P.E.K.K.A., we'll have to go Tesla once more. And I don't think I need to protect it, please. No, it gets a hit on the Tesla, are you joking? Oh my god, this kind of sucks. Alright, so I will go Goblin Trill because he is going to have to defend it, but he did our... Dude, what the heck? He, this guy is Boulder and Valkyrie. Like, this is what I'm kind of saying, though. Like, in these type of, like, conditions, like, the only way I was able to win the last match was literally because he didn't have a counter. And that, I swear to you, that was the only match where someone didn't have a counter for the last hour. Last hour. And I just want to make sure you guys know that because although I won that match, he literally gave up and he didn't have a counter. So, I just want to say that before you guys start saying like, oh, but you won one of the matches anyways, or it's just like a skill issue, because obviously I am not the best player, but I am decently high up um, for a league. I My highest was League 8. It obviously isn't like League 9 or League 10. It is basically still mid ladder, people call it, but I did only just get double Evos this season, so I should be able to climb higher, but I definitely want to... Um, like just express like how bad the drill is because I I just want to like make sure people know how it is before they actually get it and waste their money on it because you don't even get wild cards from the drill deal either you just get a freaking emo honestly if I was like at the games like the emo's cool but I would have given wild cards too because ten dollars for a freaking evo while the other evos are like eight dollars it's I don't know I just I just don't agree with it. But I'm just going to die here anyways. Even if I placed Tesla earlier, I would have died. But honestly, like, I don't even know what to say with this freaking deck. Like, I've been trying to make a good video with this deck, trying to record some winning matches. And it's literally impossible. But anyways, I'll show you guys the decks that I was using. You can see here, this is the first deck that I was using. This is actually a variation of Riley CR's deck that he was using. It's that he had Fire Spirit instead of E-Spirit. And he actually had Evo Knight instead of Evo Tesla, but I don't have Evo Knight as you guys can see. Then I do have, this is the deck that I won with. This was a deck that I just made myself. But um, the guy did, um, did end up giving up anyways. And he didn't have many counters. So I feel like that wasn't much of like a show off compared to the freaking so many lost matches that I've freaking played in the past hour. And then this was the last deck, just a normal like Goblin Bait deck. Instead, you just have Goblin Drill instead of Goblin Gang. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really, really hope this video helps make your decision on whether or not you buy the Evo Goblin Drill because as of right now, it is not looking the best. If maybe a really good deck were to come out, obviously Evos are really good once you find like a really good deck with it, but I don't know. Maybe if that happened, it would be good, but as of right now, I don't think Evo Goblin Drill is a really good Evo and I don't think it's even worth buying and I honestly regret spending $10 on it, but... 
it was for YouTube anyways. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and have a great day, you guys.